what's up YouTube you checking out the frequent flyer and it's somewhat of a beautiful day today nice and breezy out here a little sun but I'm out here with the King Kong fly egg 130 again and check it out y'all it's got black motors on it so I exchanged the motors I swapped them out for some 7500 kV 1104 motors they're, they're jumper branded. They came from an Ishii model that was trash. <laughs> but anyhow, this thing flies pretty nice. I have flown it already. So I'm about to show you guys how it flies. It doesn't get hot. The motors here are more better ventilated than the stock motors that come with this thing. So they're a higher KV at 7,500, whereas the, the stock motors are 7,000 KV. These are 7,500 kV, and the stock motors are 1105 supposedly, and these are 1104, but they look exactly the same size, same dimensions and everything, so I don't understand that. Uh, same with the leader 120, it's said to have 1104 motors, but they look identical to the supposedly 1105 motors that are on the King Kong 110 GT. But that's another story anyhow these motors are more better ventilated than the stock motors so these don't get as warm so that could be exactly be the problem with the stock motors that could be the culprit the fact that it doesn't have these ventilation holes on the top of the motors, so that's why it warms up a little so I'm not going to talk you guys head off Gonna try to get this thing in the air now. We're gonna fly it with this GMB 600 milliamp hour 50C to 100C burst battery here. So pretty decent battery. I got the Devo 10 out here to control this thing. We're doing DSMX. And also to show you guys, I did use some zip ties right here on all four arms to hold down the motor wires and also to hold down the antennas for the receiver this is a, a dsm x satellite receiver diversity and i have each antenna held down by the zip tie there and as you can see i cut a little slit in the foam so they can fit right in the groove there and so it's pretty nicely cut out let me plug it in now. The buzzer is going off because I don't have the Vigo on yet. Got the wrong protocol set up on my Vigo. I was flying the U807, a blast from the past. I was flying that earlier. Didn't get a chance to get that on video it was a spur of the moment thing i apologize guys i know a lot of you guys probably want to see that one so let's see if we can get a nice signal for this okay so i'm just going to fly it line of sight so there it is punch out so still nice punch out on it still nice and quiet still has that little wobble in the wind though <laughs> on 2s anyhow on 3s it doesn't wobble so much Wind's trying to push it around a lot.
man, it's breezy out there. Dragonfly just flew right past my face. Excellent reception with these DSM satellites. Still no buzzer. Oh, there we go. My little three minute alarm there going off. So that's it, a quick demonstration flight of this King Kong 130 fly egg and the motors are barely even warm. So usually the motors will be uh, a little warm motors are almost cold here guys so I think this is a really awesome upgrade next we're gonna fly this thing with 3s and test that out thanks for watching